Hey guys, we're backstage at Milton Keynes Pride and I'm so excited to be joined by the incredible, the iconic LGBT legend. It's Heather oh. Pease. Heather, how are you doing? I am so hot. Guys, look, I'm really sorry for the state of me. The, make <laughs> the makeup's melted. So be done. Um, I've had to put, yeah, it's just, what an amazing event. I am, um, I'm absolutely thrilled to be here. Keith and the team have done such an awesome job have, and to keep it, have. keep it free. Um, obviously, we've had the weather today. I hope there's not yeah. not too many people with sunstroke. We survived, we survived. <laughs> but it was hot, it was hot on that stage today, and um, yeah, but the crowd rocked. Everyone just looks so happy. It's like the last throws of summer. <laughs> it really is. It feels like the last big event of summer, honestly. Yeah, it does. The audience here. I mean, we've got some incredible acts, but they were really a lot of them were here for you tonight. Yeah. You could just tell by the reaction from them all. They're so excited to have you here. Obviously, you've done so much for the LGBT community. You must have been to countless pride. Yeah. What is it that for you makes the perfect pride, you know? I think it's just the coming together as a community, um, celebrating who we are, feeling like we're the majority for a day. Yes. Um, feeling like you can just be yourself if you want to kiss your girlfriend, your boyfriend, whatever, you know. Um, for me, um, at home I take the kids to Brighton Pride, I live in Brighton and they have a family day on the Sunday. It's really lovely for my kids to feel like they're part of the majority and not yes. the only ones with two moms or two dads. Absolutely. Or, um, so it's just, it's a celebration and I mean there is still so much to be done worldwide. There, there really, really is. Um, but it's, it's important when we can be visible for those countries who can't, you know, to give them a bit of hope. 100% to take a look and see, right, this is how we're doing it. It is for the community, it's for the families. This is such a family orientated pride, you yeah. know. Just walking around so you've really got something for absolutely everyone here, you know. Yeah. And it's incredible just to see it. So obviously Keith puts this all on, it's a completely free pride. Why do you think everyone should come to MK Pride next year? Um, just the feel of it really. Um, it, it feels really generous of spirit. Um, it feels like a really safe place. Um, I definitely have no problem bringing my kids. They were going to come today, but when I left, it was 32 degrees <laughs> and it was either a three hour drive to Milton Keynes or getting in the sea. So Definitely the sea, I would say, for the children. <laughs> but maybe if I get invited back and it's not 32 degrees, they'll they'll come next. I would I'm definitely bring them here. It's so, it's, it does that. just feel safe. I'm sure you will. And just from the reactions from the crowd and everyone here, we've been, all been so incredibly excited to have you. I'm sure we'll see you back again. You're you know, a very beautiful looking man, aren't you? <laughs> Is that you? You're, got, you're a beautiful just woman, just honestly. And lost in his eyes. <laughs> making me blush now it's not just the heat <laughs> Heather, thank you so much You're for joining us today we've had the most wonderful time with I've, you i've had the best time i wish i could stay this evening but i've thank got to get home so much. we'll see you next year hopefully hopefully Keith, <laughs> call me back <laughs>